So, 19.2 is here, and I'm a little bit nervous for it, because obviously it's a strength element, and I'm kind of fucked against the big boys. So the punishment is singing in an ice bath, bye bye bye. So it's gonna be so good. We created a group chat on WhatsApp, talking trash talk to each other, and it's been so fun. So I'm gonna help you guys out, trash talk, getting ready for the build up of this workout. Tiago set the punishment and said these exact words. Good morning guys, nice to know that I have a nice ice bath recovery this weekend. Fuck off, this is the kind of workout that I suck at. 315 is Liam's goal for 2037. Brian, too soon. Basically, they're saying that I'm not gonna lift 315 until 2037. Basically, they're giving me crap because I'm the weakest one in the group, but little do they know I've got the best engine. Poor them. This is what happened to Brian in 2016. Get up. Get up. I know, oh, like, don't even get me started, it was terrible. Then, Mika made this meme of it. Oh, look at this, somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this! Damn! I don't know, he's fucking hilarious. And I don't know if Tiago's gonna do it with me and Brian, but me and Brian are gonna do it now, so let's head to the gym. Say, so take seat. This is what happens when you run out of C4 and you've only got a little bit left and you've got heavy cleans. So you're off, lad. Let's get this part on the road. Probably gonna spill it on my jeans. Don't really care, honestly. Cause I only need the crew plus me. We stay all day. UK, okay. Just vibes. We slide all day, all night, all night, all night, all night, all night. I don't stop, I don't sleep. Cause I only need my crew plus me. All night, all night, all night, all night. All night. Only need my crew plus me. All night. All night. All night. All night. All night. Only need my crew plus me. All night. Only one place we wanna be. Only need the crew plus me. Don't know who we're gonna see, but I heard they play a couple CDs. Eight quid for a GT. Probably gonna spill it on my jeans. Don't really care honestly, cause I only need the crew plus me. We stay. stay! I'll be honest, first week, I should, should, be, should have probably beat Brian aerobically, and Brian should have probably be, beat me on this one. So it's 1-1 one, one between us. Oh man, I'm happy for me. I got two, last in 2016 I got two reps at 225. This year I got two at 275, which is my goal, so I'm always happy. Let's see Tiago, shall we? See how he's gonna get on. Okay, so Tiago's not free, so we're gonna ask Monsoor. He wanted to act all natural. Monsoor! He wanted. Oh, <laughs> I was just going to stop my workout. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> he is the worst actor in the world. If there's an award for worst actor, I'd win it. Oh, I'm a winner. <laughs> You're a winner of losers. Yeah. <laughs> so, we're talking about 19.2. Yes. I beat the guys. I beat the guys, even though he's the smallest guy in the gym. I'm in the gym. Sorry. I'm in between the, 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 the big boys. He's not a big boy. He's a, He's 81 kilos. So are you? 81.5. <laughs> you want to show them? No, no, no. no, no. you and me, I'm just kidding. Basically, um, even though I won a lifting event, it was more of a toaster bar. That's what Tiago says. It's basically, if you have a strong core, you're going to be pretty fucking good. Yeah. Three tips to give people to get a strong core. Do CrossFit. <laughs> do CrossFit. No, do... Uh, please do CrossFit. <laughs> That didn't work! Rewind. <laughs> oh guys! <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ask Elton, fuck this. Alright, Elton. What's up? Quick tips. Three tips to get strong 
or a six pack. To get strong abs or a six pack. Abs, I recommend every day. It's an endurance muscle. I would highly recommend doing it every day, like the calf muscles. So I'm saying to the guys how 19-2 is probably a toes to bar workout. So saying it's more dominant, and if you've got a strong core, you're probably gonna do well. Definitely. Rather than heavy lifts. Definitely. So if you've got the skills all there, cleans and double unders, it's gonna be a toast bar workout. It'll help a lot too. Three exercises to get a strong core. Oh, I love the hollows. The hollow, hollow rocks. Holds, hollow rocks and holds. Um, my favorite is hanging on the bar knee raises, but to the side at an angle. And then entirely for the core, I like the prone cobra, which is well. That? When you're on the floor, it's like a superman bringing your chest up and shoulders back. Helps the lower back, the glutes, and the arms. Okay, so yeah, the whole core in general, so that's awesome. It's like the Superman, hollow rock, hanging your nose with a twist, Those are my really favorites. attacking the core. This is perfect functional fitness, I would say, but I think that's pretty good. Grab Tiago because he lost because his core is so fucking shit, and he's a fat wanker, and that's why I beat him. Do I have a core? <laughs> Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> I said to Tiago, act natural for the video. <laughs> so, Tiago. It's was natural. Yeah, yeah, you're so natural. Yes. 19.2, I beat your ass on a heavy clean workout. No, it's not heavy cleans, man. 70%. Also, it's all about the toshu bar. Like I said, it's all about the ab work, and it's basically about having a strong core, and Tiago clearly doesn't have a strong core. Man, massively strong. <laughs> all right, Tiago, quickly, one tip to give the guys on how to get a strong core or a six pack. Guys, work on strict movements, like hollows, holds, and everything. Strict toshu bar, that's it. What is that? <laughs> I was just staring at you to make it awkward. Okay. What I suggest is for you guys is one important thing to make sure you're getting a six pack or having a strong core, and that is nutrition. Clearly, all the guys have been saying to get a strong core or a six pack, we need to focus on the clear movements toes to bar, knee raises, leg raises, hollow positions. This is going to get us nice and strong, but we need to really focus on dialing on nutrition if we want to look good because. All about performance, yes, we are gonna be strong, but we want also everyone wants to look good at the same time. The most important thing for that is nutrition. These are two books that I would definitely recommend all these people. You've got Joe Wicks and Jamie Oliver. So Jamie Oliver is pretty good at giving you more traditional foods and making them a little bit more healthy. Whereas Joe Wicks is really good at making quick food that you can cook at night, which is probably better for everyone. And also, I suggest this one <laughs> to get a strong core. <laughs> what the fuck is it even about? <laughs> body language. <laughs> <laughs> what about body language? <laughs> With regards to the movements, I would Elton suggest doing core every day, which I think is very much true, but it doesn't necessarily need to mean sets and reps of core specific because we use our core in functional movements. What I would suggest to you guys, let's just take those three exercises for example. Do three sets, three to four sets of each exercise doing between 10, 15, or even 20 reps on the hollow rocks. Try and add minimal rest in between. That is gonna get the muscular endurance in the muscle, in the muscle a lot better. In the upcoming videos, I'm gonna give you guys nutrition tips, either in the next video or the video after, so watch out for that. I'm gonna be showing you some really quick, easy meals that I would recommend. There's an awesome peanut butter chicken dish and a nice stir fry, a nice healthy beef stir fry that I like to cook, which I think is gonna be awesome for tracking calories and macros, where I'll talk about that in another video. But guys, this is what I suggest for you guys to get six pack abs or strong core, which is gonna help you out in that open workout, help you out in CrossFit, and even help you look good naked. Remember, those, those movements are probably gonna help you out, maybe with some other accessory movements as well, but hope this has helped you. Until next time, peace.